how beautiful is it that we could communicate with whoever we may want to communicate with any second of any day really with the with the technology that we have now with the social media that we have now i wanted to talk to y'all today about that how there's such a beauty in social media in current social media but also there's such a curse as well in social media i want you all to try your best to limit the things that consume you on a daily basis on social media and i'm speaking through experience i've been there before i know what it feels like to go on instagram for you know hours to go on facebook for hours you know to go on twitter i don't use twitter personally but to go on twitter for however long and it just drains your mind and your body you're truly physically exhausted from that and you're literally not doing anything so i want you all to try to shift your shift your shift your efforts when you're on your smartphone to to a a place where it's beneficial for you for example i love youtube if y'all don't have a youtube account you don't really need one you just go on youtube and you could learn an immense amount of stuff from watching videos on youtube do it yourself videos how to build strong relationships how to be a successful entrepreneur anything that you guys might be interested in how to draw those are the that's the benefits that's the beauty of social media but then I'll look at my Facebook timeline and I'll see that however many views or people are, you know, were watching two teenagers fist fighting at a park after school until, you know, someone bleeds or gets knocked out. I I just don't I just don't understand that. I don't understand how that is making your life any better at all by watching a violent video or watching domestic abuse or watching so much of celebrity gossip or drama i understand people have their have their hobbies you know they have their interest in certain things i apologize for the wind i hope y'all can hear me i understand you know we all have our interests in certain different things but i'm just trying to make this video today because i don't want it to consume you i don't want to ultimately consume you because i've been there so i want you to do your best and come to the realization of how much you're using a certain website or social media app if you want to call it I want you to come to the realization. For example, I try to use my, I, I don't always do it, but I try to use my Instagram three times a day. Just three times a day. I'll check it three times a day. So that way I'm putting my mind to better use and being more productive with my life. Whether it's learning, you know, exercising physically, mentally, anything in general. I realize that these certain websites or applications on your phone as addicting as they may be or as you know intriguing as they may be to stay on when you're bored they're ultimately not really benefiting our life in basically any way so i want you all to try to limit it as much as you possibly can social media and if you're going to use your phone a lot try to gear it towards something that will teach you more rather than pictures or you know tweets of things that really don't have such an you know positive impact on your life or a meaningful impact on your life so i wanted to share that with y'all next time you're watching a video scroll past that fight video of the two violent kids fighting each other two teenagers getting forced basically to fight each other because everyone around them wants to put it on their vine or put it on a youtube channel don't watch those kind of videos watch a video of where a woman i saw this the other day a woman is 32 years old completely deaf for her entire life she walks into a doctor's office they install a an instrument in, into her ear and for the first time in her entire life she can hear she hears sound waves sound waves enter her eardrum and exit her eardrum that is the beauty of social media the fact that we can connect with someone across the world that is the beauty of social media not you know what did kanye west do last night you know what i mean it's just certain things you know that will truly help you and ignite your soul and there's certain things that could destroy your soul the choice is yours ultimately but i'm just here trying to help y'all believe excel achieve god bless y'all